Hello, and welcome to this episode of Product of the Week. I'm your host and maker, Robin Mitchell. Now, in a previous episode, I know we talked about the PCIe expander on the Raspberry Pi 5 and how it will basically transform future projects. Well, in this episode, we will be looking at, thank you, Richard, the NVMe base for the Raspberry Pi 5, which can only be described as the future of Pi memory access. Unless you are completely dense and can't figure it out from the name, the NVMe base for the Raspberry Pi 5 is an add-on board that connects to the Pi's PCIe connector and provides you with an NVMe slot for high-speed storage. Now, to be clear, this isn't a hat that connects to the GPIO header. No, this connects to the PCIe connector, which is much faster and doesn't interfere with your GPIO. Eight hundred megabytes per second. That is the number that makes this board f***ing awesome. Eight hundred megabytes per second. That is the top data transfer rate when reading from an SSD connected to this NVMe adapter card. Try doing that on a puny little micro SD card. Now, writing won't be as fast, but these speeds alone clearly show why this add-on card is awesome. Just think of the applications you can do with these kinds of speeds. I'm thinking AI, data serving, etc. 800 megabytes. That's the only feature you need. Okay, we're done. All right, next. Okay, so a read speed of 800 megabytes per second would be a maximum. So not all drives would support that, but even then this card would allow for some serious transfer rates. With regards to writing, this board is capable of supporting up to 450 megabytes per second. So again, you can do some serious data shifting in real time, giving it all kinds of capabilities. With regards to SSD support, the NVMe base for Raspberry Pi 5 can handle sizes from 2230 to 2280. But considering that I've never used an NVMe in my life, those numbers are kind of meaningless to me. Finally, this add-on board also comes with a flat cable needed to connect it to the Pi, some rubber feet, an SSD mounting bolt, and standoffs for base mounting. So with such a fast read and write speed, there are so many things this add-on unlocks. To start, this add-on makes the Pi 5 actually useful, far beyond an over-glorified mini computer that has limited capabilities. If combined with a gigabit ethernet port, you can make an effective media server capable of handling multiple streaming requests, all while doing many other background tasks, such as downloading files, making backups, and serving files. Another excellent use of this board is in any AI-related application that demands a high read-write speed. This could be for data gathering that will eventually be used in AI training, or it could be used in the actual AI processing itself, whereby large files are needed to be accessed. This is often a problem when loading large models. Finally, the high-speed nature of this board also makes it great for creating web servers. The high-speed nature of the NVMe over PCIe means that web servers can serve websites far quicker than a typical Pi using an SD card. If combined with multiple Pis and a load balancer, it becomes possible to then create a mini data center with some killer data speeds. The Pi is great, but adding this to a Pi makes it perfect. The high speed offered by the NVMe base for Raspberry Pi 5 means that no project out there will ever suffer from data transfers ever again. So if your project needs to move any seriously large files in a short amount of time, you really need to get this. If you like what we do here at Electromaker and want to show your support, then give us a like, subscribe, and head over to the Electromaker store where you can get this and much more for your future projects. This is Robin Mitchell, signing off.